Tonight's program is a symphonic journey, touching down in seven different countries. And with the help of video and music, we'll gain an appreciation for how 19th century Europe helped shape the beautiful world that we live in today. The theme of the concert is romanticism and nationalism. Nearly all the music we'll hear today is from about the same generation, from the late 1800s, from the Romantic Age. And this music championed national causes, and it also supported this exciting notion of common people finally taking the reins in their society. From Norway to Italy, from England to the Czech Republic. We'll start in Austria with a Habsburg waltz. You know, the Habsburgs were really the energy and the elegance of the day. And in the 1860s, it was the cultural peak of that empire, and the waltz was all the craze. The Habsburgs ruled a vast empire, and they were great patrons of the arts. That's why Mozart and Beethoven and Strauss and all these great composers went to Vienna to create all that beautiful music. Strauss was the heartthrob of the Romantic Age in Vienna. With his violin, he could whip up the crowds into a frenzy, and he helped create that waltz craze. This piece gives us a sense of the pride and the joy of Vienna. It is by Johann Strauss Jr., his number one hit of 1867, <laughs> on the beautiful Blue Danube. 